Alright, so welcome back. Should probably stop saying that yes. in case it drives people mad, especially those that if they are watching this series for a playlist and the start of uh, every episode. Okay, welcome back and uh Hang on a sec. I have no idea what happened there. The game sort of went black screen and minimised. I had to reset the resolution. This game's definitely sort of been a bit weird. I've even had problems with it glitching. Like when I exit the game and it doesn't properly close, but yeah, as I was saying, people watching the playlist here in every beginning of the episode. Welcome back, welcome back. They're probably just gonna if they hear that again, they're probably just gonna shoot themselves. But I think what we're gonna do this time is oh crap, we need to sell this shit. I forgot I had all this. I think we can flog it here. I think. to this young lady so thanks to some good citizens in the comments I've had a few um, one good citizen pointed out in um, episode 2 I was a spanner and I essentially sold or Gave away five gold. So I gave away five gold in episode two, and so yeah, that was a bit of it's a bit of stupidity for yes. me. But it was, it was also pointed out that um, good citizen in a recent in a, from episode nine pointed out. Um, Pointed out, um, like what also I talked about in depth for more of the combat. Whoa, this person doesn't even have the gold. But yeah, they pointed out in depth the combat a bit more. I uh, can sort of hold attacks and swing different directions, which I learned about that. Um, I'll take some of this back. Poor lady can't afford it. How much gold have we got now? Well, we're getting stacked. Gonna quickly save that. Stacking the monies. But I think what I was gonna do is I'm gonna explore more of Morrowind. Gotta to talk to that young lady Let's first. Hit. about Let's hear the young man we um, brought the young man's life we brought to an end as you'll know from last episode and my frames are dying tonight yeah there he is dead as shit Nels Lendo okay Nelos Omar how the fuck I gave him that name I don't know it's probably someone else's but he, he dead Dead as shit. The realm is now a better place. Peace and prosperity now reigns over the land. But what I think we was going to do was um, sort of continue and just explore more winds. Speak to that young lady first. 
because I don't know if I mentioned this before, but I don't know how she will respond. I don't know if she'll, when we speak to her, she'll be like, you killed, you killed Lendo, you bastard. Or it won't recognize the fact that I killed him. It wasn't that like program that way, and she's like, "Have you still gave him the glove? Have you have you given him the glove? Please give him the glove." <laughs> it's like, "Ma'am, I've killed him." And he's like, "Give him the glove." And uh, or if it's that, and if it's that case, then we could probably maybe go back to him and put the glove on his dead corpse, like in his inventory, and then come back. And she's like, "Oh, what did he say?" And it'll probably just be like some, I don't know, whatever follows up with that. Like, dialogue that was probably scripted or whatever. I think she's right up here. If I remember correctly. But damn, we look badass with this armor. It's not fully complete because we're a beast race and this game's discriminant. But... Who knows, we might find some armor that can work with beasts, like a full helm that works with beast races and things like that. Damn, this woman stands out here day and night. I wonder why she gets mugged. I wonder why you get fucked up, ma'am. How does the day greet you, friend? You mean the night? Um... I'll be right back. So as expected, she, um, you know, didn't recognize it, so... <laughs> well, we've stripped him of pretty much everything, we've, um, we've sort of gave him this nice feminine, feminine glove. You, you enjoy that, Lendo. You enjoy that. It's from a nice young lady who loves you. Oh, do, do you have anything? Oh, she asked me as well. Do you, do you love her? Do you have anything to say? No? Suppose a corpse? No? No? Well, he's got the glove. Don't know if that's now going to trigger her. It might not, but we're going to find out. So it's now raining. So it's thunder. Good wishes to you, friend. Lightning. Right, um Yeah. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Um well Murray, um, I've, I hate to break it to you, but Lendo's kind of dead. I kind of bludgeoned his skull in with my huge fuck-off hammer. So, I apologise about that. I'm sure I sort of warned before apologies in advance that it was probably going to result in bloodshed, and it did. Maybe I should give her a glove back, but I'm not running back again. <laughs> I might again at some point, but man's man's wants to get things done, like explore the rest of Morrowind and see see if how different other places are, and you know, see if there's better armor and all that other good stuff instead of straight away hopping into the Imperial Guard or the Fighters Guild. If we can hop into the Fighters Guild right away. We can. I could probably take the dude on. I might do that. But now there's some crazy magic shit going on now. But we could look for the Imperial Guard place that I could join, but. I think before I sort of join them, I sort of want to explore more. So now I might find some other group of people like, hey, join us. 
I have a companion who's like, oh, uh, like, you know, a fan's like, hey, can, can I be a, be friends? Can I enter friendship? Don't know why, but I just so, like, would, like, really like to have a companion or two. So have, like, a little party. So when you run into dickheads like Mel Slendo, you're like, right, dickhead, go and fucking do you in! So, um... That would be nice. I don't think I've ever been this way before. Saran. Saran. I don't think I've ever been this way before. I am trekking down a new path. Ladies and gentlemen. I think. Damn it. Yep. Still got to have a crap to sell as well. Should have ideally gone to Balmora. Took a sold all that crap. Or stuff that I stole from Balmora. <laughs> I can't even remember now. I think it was. I think it was from that dude's house I robbed. And some of it from that, um other shop as well some might be from that imperial place back in that back in Pelgade as well so guess in a way that I oh is that a giant maggot or is that one of the nice giant maggots from armoured looking ones like one we just passed as I was just saying pretty much the reason we sort of got all this armor was we did do a lot of stealing Stealing, um, killing them cutthroat dudes that tried to get us in our sleep. Who happened to have so expensive armor we've actually bled that woman dry. She's got the armor, but she's broke now. Damn, there's always. I don't even recall these places being revealed. Oh shit. So killing them cutthroat dudes had expensive armor. And the dude we had to find gave us money as well and there's a guy standing here. Can check from behind, be like, what are? Ha! What are? Yeah, you can sort of jab, swing, over, overhead swing, and. I swear we were just doing like a sideways one. There we go. Sideways, so it's like there's a stab, a sideways swing, and overhead. So who are you? If you're gonna mug me, I will fuck your shit up. Hello. Please. Wait, hello. Please, might you be of some assistance? My friend is lost and I'm very worried about him. Your friend, eh? Yes, my friend, Eldress Oriel, and I... And I were travelling to Vivi. I just looked at that on the map. And he heard a strange animal sound nearby. Beach sperm whales? He's sort of an amateur naturalist, and he felt compelled to seek out what was making the noise. Yes. That was hours ago, and I'm afraid something terrible has happened to him. If you could find him, and bring him back safely, I'd really appreciate it. I'd go myself, but I'm really more of a scholar. As he is, that's why we were travelling together. A little safety in numbers, you know? Can you help? I totally agree with that. Safety in numbers. Ah, oh, thank you. I'll suck your dick. So, Vivi. He's gone to Vivi. Oh! 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 Demon! Ah, oh, fuck. Um, you're gonna help? This. Oh. 
got fucked up, mate. Right? You got fucked up. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah, you like that, don't you? Yeah. The fuck? Jesus. I'm starting to think I'm playing Ark Survival. It's got a fucking dinosaur. Sorry, stranger. My time is short, so. My life is short. Jesus. So he went off to Vivi all the way back there. Time we get there. I'll, I'll, even when I'm gonna cut out, when I get there, like cut all me just running back there, it's gonna like pretty run out of time. My lord. And I've got to sell this shit as well. I think I think I stole stuff from like every part. I think that armor I took was from that fault next to Balmora. Where I sold the package. Nonetheless, I am going to continue forth. He actually did a lot of damage. Found a place here. I'm gonna get ready to sleep on the ground as well. I'm gonna quickly do that now. Really? Enemies in here, man. Jesus. I don't need that. That was probably bent. What? Oh! Demon! Oh, this is bad. I need to run. I need to run. Um, I have no idea what's going on with my screen, but I'm getting fucked up. So that's why I couldn't sleep. This place is fucked. Ooh. I'm in trouble. Well. Shit. So I'd sort of say, well, if I go low back, that's not too much a problem, but. Because nothing happened with Mori, but I spoke to that dude, so that was progress. That was about it, that's the only progress. But the deeper you go in Morrowind, the bigger the fucking monsters get, and your shit is gonna get wrecked. Right now, I'm gonna take on the ghost, because I've seen his kind before. And I am ready. Come at me, foul beast! Back to once thou came. Oh no. No, please. Please, understand. Get fucked. Yeah, so that person also in the comments told me that. Doing like the rapid attack thing does only little damage. Whereas if you hold it, it does the job. See, I'm fucking him up right now. I'm hearing it connecting. But he's a bitch to hit. Can you? I can't even hit. Ah, we're not going that way. That's for sure. Damn! Huge fucking pterodactyl, triceratops. It's fucking Dino Land that way. So we're not going there. We can tell that place to fuck right off. I think we've got some weapon Any efficiency, but... Damn. Yes. Well, when we run past that Mori woman again, we're slapping her with that glove. If we're going that way, I'm going to speed talk to that dude and head back to Vivi. That's what I'll do. I 
I was, to be honest, I was expecting just to run around, see more places, maybe see some big bugs along the way. What I was not expecting was giant demons from like demon spawns from hell to be summoned. Took on that fucking land one, but them two birds, it was like you can't see monsters nearby. I'm like, where the fuck up? There's like no monsters nearby. And then suddenly I'm getting fucking attacked from the air by these giant birds. I didn't even even think to look up, I didn't even know there was air monsters. And there was flying things that would attack you. My hammer was no effect on that ghost, it was blah. I was getting my swings off and attacks off on that pterodactyl, but then it suddenly became non effective because it was towards the end it was no longer hitting him. Uh oh, okay. I think that's a place with um some ghosties. But as we know, weapons no effect. And the second one that'll be coming up, there's that magic shit when you open the door you get fucked up. And there was also that dude thing further up who had that huge hammer like me. Who wrecked my shit. What if I give her a glove back? See what she thinks. But it's night not done. Tidings and good wishes to you, friend. To you as well. Um Good bribe I am I could even do with a thousand gold. I'm gonna try that quickly. I wanna see what happens. What was that? Yeah, it was E. So I'm gonna quickly save. And I want to see if, what bribing does with this young lady. Oh. Ah, uh, she didn't like that. About a hundred. Ah, right, she likes us. Uh, uh, um, she actually moved. I'm not familiar with that. Right, so she wants our. She pretty much. She is pretty much. Hey, I'll have your dick, but she's unfortunately we sort of screwed. Tidings and good wishes to you, friend. To you as well, but we're sort of boned in that department really now. Um, I could do that VV thing. But at the same time, I just can't be fucked. <laughs> Not especially with that what happened. Oh no. Giant make it. Fuck that. Because that was just a oh, mess. Well, I don't even think there's anything this way. Well, there's a path, but there's also a giant maggot. I'm just going to head on from Balmora. As I said, lady, night. A beautiful night, actually. But damn, fuck them. Jurassic monsters. Jeez, my, even with my armor and hammer, that didn't do shit. That was, to be fair, that's some pretty scary stuff. And it was me thinking them giant maggots were bad. God. I wonder if it was that region or is it as I'm going to go more inland. So I'm going to start encountering more giant beasts. So yeah, sort of come up where we turned right and spoke to that dude.
You know, we're not expecting this time because we got to go all the way back to Vivi to um, help him with his pal. Now, like, Quill's in the middle of a conversation with him when, like, that huge dinosaur thing came out of nowhere. That's actually. Because they've always gone that way. I've never gone up that path. I took right, but I never went up there. I think I can continue some, some somewhere, I think, from around Balmoir. I have no idea what I'm doing at this point, but. There's a time I'm going to sprint back and save it at the nearest fault place. I might actually be able to sell stuff to people here. Save really quick. I might be able to sell some of the books I've got and whatnot. I can probably sell this woman. She's still got money so I can sell her this expensive armour. Other stuff they won't take. Ha! Huh. She's f she's short by five. <laughs> she's short by five. <laughs> uh, damn, that's actually quite a good iron battle axe. I think I have efficiency in that department. I'll take that back. Do I have some efficient, I think? Major skills. Blunt weapon. Minor skills. Long blade. Axe skills. Could go for it, but it's not a major skill of mine. So I could buy it. I'm rating 13. Same as mine. Same here, I think, that's why. You like to dance close to the fire, don't you? I think I can even sell him armor. He's got a similar axe. Yeah, I can even sell him all this stuff. He's only got 400. Silver dagger. Show you that as well. Gonna keep these for now. Show you all of this good stuff. We're so rich. They end there and stop us from getting fucked up with giant monsters from the nether realm ah oh, you look you look marvelous marvelous so now we're fucking rich as fuck well, now we nearly have 2k in the monies and we've got some that magic weapons we're, we're, we're set we're looted well hope you enjoyed I somewhat to some extent did Besides the murdering and the slaughter, and I received towards the end by them giant demons, but we've learnt lesson. We're not going that way. <laughs> but until next time, see you then.